moisture that's fallen. It has been a wet start to a wet year in East Tennessee. For a while, it seemed like the rain would never end. WBIR 10 News reporter Shannon Smith shows us what to expect for the rest of the spring severe weather season. Just when you think the rain is finally gone, it comes back and it comes back strong. There are 11 days left in April and we've already seen 4.21 inches of rain this month. That's above the average April rain total of 4.01 inches and it's still going to rain more tomorrow. Storms this time of year swing from sprinkles to severe, but what makes a storm severe? Well, it's strength. A thunderstorm is considered to hit severe limits when it has winds of 58 miles per hour or greater and hail one inch in diameter. That's about the size of a quarter. So why does severe weather happen in the spring? It has to do with a whole slew of different temperatures in different parts of the country. Summer weather is starting in the south, but winter weather is still hanging around in the north. When those air masses clash, we get severe storms. And in East Tennessee, they create tornadoes, large hail, and most commonly, damaging winds. 10 News meteorologists say so far this year, our spring severe weather season has been pretty mild. It runs from March through the end of May or early June. So while there are no severe storms in the immediate forecast, be prepared for anything. Back to you. Shannon, and you can keep up with the latest conditions using the WBIR weather app there. You can check out the radar along with the hour by hour and seven day forecasts. You can download it for free in the app store. We now know the name of